Let's we see the short answer of a rate of spring by Arthur Miller. First one, how is the rate of spring by Stravinsky related to the title of this essay? The rate of spring is ballad and corrections conserved by the Russian composer Igor Stravinsky. It is a celebration of beauty and fertility of the spring season. Arthur Miller's essay is likewise com contemplations on the possibilities that the spring season is brings. Next one, cite two examples from the essay that are evidence of Arthur's love for gardening. The author cultivates the gardens even though he does not like vegetables. He also confesses that buying them from the supermarket is easier than cultivating them. This instance shows his love for gardening. Next one, what did the author do with black plastic in between the rows of plants and why did he can't continue using black plastic later? He unrolled sheets of plastic between rows to keep the soil moist in dry times and wet free. He stopped using plastic because it looks so industrial and unromantic. What are the advantages did using hay mulch over plastic have? The author cuts a lot of hay and rootens hay in improved the compositions of the soil. In addition to that, it came free and the author thought that it looked beautiful. Next one, what attraction did certain gardeners drive from gardening according to Miller? The attractions of gardening are neurotic and moral. It helps people to do something, concentrate and produce something tangible. When life itself seems pointless, it develops a person's maternal and parental instincts as a plant become the offspring. How did the author Samarin La, a botanist, learn not to be an outspoken truthful women. With advancing years and more lived experience, the author mother-in-law learned to become less outspoken. Why does the author continue to gardening despite all complaints has about the activity? The author continues gardening because he can't tolerate the sight of an uncultivated garden. What was it that was uh, far lovelier than rows of hot dogs? A vegetable garden glancing in the sun and glen glittering with the dew is a sight far lovelier than a row of hot dogs. How are gardening and character building related according to the author? A gardener always lives with the hope of doing better with his garden the next year. It reflects a person's preference and reluctance to continue striving despite failures. What is the significance of the author's statement in conclusion that the essay was written on one of the coolest days in December? It tells the readers that the author wrote the essay on gardening during December when he was forced to remain indoors. He could not cultivate his garden because of frozen ground and the lack of sun. The desire for summer was as it peaks during this time and therefore he has a lot of good things to say about gardening. Next one, four more question answer. What are the reasons for Miller's habit of gardening and why would the consider not doing gardening? How are the two related in this essay? Arthur Miller outlines his opposition for gardening and enumerates the reasons for his oppositions. The irony is that he can't give a convincing reasons that would justify his the endeavor. He even states that the effort one put into growing vegetable is often not rewarded fully. He thinks that he continues growing vegetables because the human race has been cultivating the earth for time immortal. Every year he decides that he would not cultivate the garden. The next smells the next years but he revolves his shaken when the sun comes out and when he smells the fresh air. Maintaining a garden makes the author realize how delicate our planet is. 
Milton consider gardening to be a moral exercise. It serves man from the disappoints of life and helps him achieve something considerate. It also nurtures his parental instincts. Gardening is a moral occupation because there is a vast difference between your expectation and the result. Next one, what role does Miller's mother-in-law have to play in his gardening ritual? His mother-in-law makes her first visit to garden. She used to be a woman so who spoke her mind and who was always straightforward in her speech. But now she has learned from experience that it is not wise to be to do so. Now she has changed that instinct of giving suggestions about planting by then. She would wait till October when she makes her annual trip to her home. He, her advice by October is of no use that upsets the narrator to decide not to plan it anything next time. In spite of such decisions, the thoughts of emp emptiness of the garden motivates him to plan again. The sight of dozens of green shades leaves glittering in the sun, beautiful vegetables are lovelier to admire than the hot dogs. Here the writer changes his mind by preferring pans of over the hot dogs. His uh, healthy growth reflects in our uh, orderliness in one's own sprite as well as. Thus the writer changes his mind by accepting that the April is for gardening. What does Miller mean when he says he can't understand people who say they are allowed to garden? The writer changes his opinions once again by claiming that gardening is pointless, time-consuming hobby. He further states that he does not understand why people love gardening because gardening is not a simple hobby or habit to love but it is about the character building. A garden can be seen as an extension of oneself. It is a place where their determinations will continue. It also allow one to accept one's mistake. It helps in character building. Gardening is not a simple task, but it means more that it is why Adam is a gardener. The gardener can become hopeful after repeated failures. He believes that this year will have a good harvest, even though there might be disasters like drought, flood, and tapion. God has done his job properly and chosen the right occupation for mankind because only man can regain hope uh, after repeated failures because in new and better possibilities. He concludes the essay by stating that he wrote it is the coldest December he might once he reads to justify his lack of interest in gardening as a result of climate Yet he pointed out the role of gardening as a character building. What is the meaning of the title? Miller in his short essay, Rate of Spring, talks about his love and reluctance for gardening. Miller used the title from the musical ballad of Russian composer. The Russian composer Stravinsky ballad's English title, The Rate of Spring, is about a region ritual scene in which a girl danced before being sacrificed. The wise elder of the Bijan society are seated in the circle and are observing the dance. Later they are offering the girl as a sacrifice to God of spring in order to gain his blessing. The word rite means sad ceremony or act. Here Miller may call gardening as ceremony that is done in the spring season. In the video, please like, share and comment. Subscribe and press the bell icon. Thank you for watching.